Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign of Aries. Aries, this is your weekly general reading for the 4th through the 10th of November 2019. So I'm using the Oracle of the Unicorns along with the tea leaf. I will be using the Gilded Tarot for your weekly general messages. And at the end of your reading, Aries, I will be pulling several positive thought cards for you as well. So we have Receive coming up here. Beautiful energy. All right. Thank you, Spirit. All right, Spirit. What extra messages do you have for Aries? Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay. So we have Lion. Love it. Thank you, Spirit. Aries. Oh. We have Ladder. We have scissors, and we have flowers. Very interesting. Okay. Let's move these over. There we go. Okay. All right, spirit. What does Aries, sun, moon, and rising need to know this week, spirit? 4th through the 10th of November, 2019. Thank you, spirit. Thank you. All right, Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising Spirit. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. All right, we are ready. Situation of the week. I love it. So Aquarius just had this in the same spot as well. Your situation of the week is the Wheel of Fortune. Beautiful energy. Crossing you, Queen of Pentacles. In your foundation, we have the Five of Cups. Recent past energies, Eight of Wands. Whoops, Eight of Wands. <laughs> Crowning you is the Page of Cups. That Page of Cups is coming out in a lot of readings. It's going to be very important for everyone to listen to your intuition. Your new circumstance is the Three of Cups. Okay. From the bottom of the deck, the overall energy is the Page of Wands. This is your energy, Aries. Okay. Right. Let's start here. Receive. Be open to receiving goodness. Believe you are worthy of abundance. A gift is coming to you soon. There is a gift. There's a blessing coming. Uh, it's going to be very important for you to be open to receiving it. You have beautiful energies here, Aries. I do feel that there has been some type of challenge uh, obstacle in your recent past and you are moving out of that uh, during this time make sure that life's ups and downs haven't gotten you so down that you don't see something or miss something that's coming your way okay uh, for some reason that uh, that needs to be known there all right and know you're worthy Know you are worthy. You have the Page of Wands. This is you, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius right here. Uh, this is very positive. This talks about, for many of you, having a creative vision, starting new projects, having a lot of self-confidence that's backing whatever you're beginning right here. For some of you, this is definitely news coming in that's alerting you to something that's very exciting. This could be a new career, a new job. Uh, it's going to be different because there are so many of you watching. But in some area of your life, there's, there's something that you have a lot of passion about. And something you've been waiting to hear. And it's coming. Now, we have Lion here. It's time to act. There's some area in your life you need to take action on. Okay? And you need to be bold about it. Step into that Emperor Aries energy and take action. You have the ladder. Climbing towards success. Okay, beautiful energy. Some of you may be moving up within a company. You may have recently started a business and now it's really starting to take off. There's a lot of growth and expansion. You have scissors. This disappointment in some affair. Okay, and you do have the five of cups. It's coming up in your foundation. So this disappointment's already happened. 
whatever this challenge was, it's already happened. But you have chosen to really uh, see what's still available to you and move forward. Now you have flowers coming up here. Happiness, okay? Um, whatever this that's coming in here, whatever you're starting, whatever you... This could have been a project or a new business you've already started. Uh, there could be a lot of joy and happiness that's starting to come back. That's coming to fruition to you in your situation. Now, this could be a new job offer, a career change as well, like I said a moment ago. There's a lot of excitement around this. Now, you have the Wheel of Fortune, okay, as your situation of the week. And I, this is amazing. This is you writing this wheel. You're not writing against it. This talks about karma, your destiny. This talks about you taking positive uh, chances, being inspired. This talks about you coming out of those challenges and obstacles that you have recently been dealing with. And now luck is on your side. Amazing. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. You're very down to earth. You're very practical. You know what you want. Uh, you know the Queen of Pentacles is whether you're male or female. Talks about your stability, your security. Uh, for many of you, you're laying a solid, unshakable foundation. This is what you want. You want stability and security with your, your financial situation. Okay? And it's coming. Now, you have the Five of Cups coming up here in your foundation. This is what's moving you forward. This is what's driving you this week. Now, this is a alchemical, a spiritual alchemical process that you're using here. Because you're taking whatever loss, disappointment this was... And you're using it to fuel you. You're choosing to turn a negative into a positive. <clears throat> Amazing energy right here, Aries. Pat yourself on the back. This is you taking whatever this disappointment, whatever this loss was, whatever this setback was. And choosing to see the other opportunities that are still available to you and running with it. In your recent past, we have the Eight of Wands. This talks about what you put out is coming back very quickly. This could have been job interviews, of career choices or decisions. Um, whatever you've been working towards, what you've been putting your time and effort in. Now, things are happening. It's picking up. The speed is picking up very quickly. And it's very positive. Uh, I feel like recently there's been some exciting news that has come into your situation, your life. Some of you may be traveling over air. You may be, uh, you know, you may have recently um, took on a career or a job that requires you to travel. But I feel like there's a lot of enthusiasm. Whatever this has to do with, there's a lot of passion that's backing it, okay? Now you have the Page of Cups coming up here in your crowning position. This is what you know. This is what you're thinking about. Cancer Scorpio Pisces energy. This is you listening to your intuition. This is you understanding that psychic energy that's flowing within you and through you. Listening to your own inner guidance to guide you. Really tapping into that energy. And this is going to be very beneficial to you. This is you paying attention to dream, sign, symbolism, and synchronicities as well. Now, your outcome energy, your new circumstances, this three of cups. Pat yourself on the back. There's a need for you to... Uh, celebrate how far you've come no matter how small you may feel it is okay you've achieved something here there's an accomplishment here this could be you planning uh, maybe time with family this could be you getting together with co-workers people that's been team players this is a good positive energy right here okay and there's a need for you to celebrate how far you've come when you celebrate, this is the number three. When you celebrate what you've achieved and you show that gratitude, it opens up for you to have an abundance of blessings. And Spirit says, be open to receive right here. Be open to receiving goodness. Believe you are worthy of abundance. A gift is coming to you soon, Aries. Now you're... Overall energy with this page of wands is a lot of enthusiasm, a lot of passion, self-confidence about what you're working towards. This could be news coming in about what you've put out. 
You have this Wheel of Fortune here. Very exciting. Uh, you are riding the wheel, not going against it. There's a change of luck coming here for you. And I feel like it's going to allow for you to really build your empire when it comes to financial stability and security with this Queen of Pentacles. The Five of Cups is definitely in the position of you turning a, a negative into a positive here and using that as fuel. Choosing to see what's still available to you. You've recently had, you know, some opportunities or something coming back to you. And it it's all surrounds what you put out. And there's a lot of excitement here. This could have been news. Emails, phone calls, whatever it was about. There's, you know, it's something you truly wanted. Always listen to your intuition and allow your inner guidance to guide you. There's a time of celebration at hand here. Be open. Show that gratitude. Show that appreciation. Pat yourself on the back for what you've achieved and you've accomplished so far. You deserve it. In some area of your life, <clears throat> it is definitely time to act. Okay? It's time to be fierce. It's time to step in that energy of the lion. For many of you, you are climbing toward success here with the ladder. This scissors, this is just clarifying this energy of the Five of Cups, disappointment in some affair, that you are turning it around. You're turning it around where it's going to benefit you. The flowers, you know, this is represents your happiness, your joy. What you're working towards, what's taking place in your life is going to bring a great deal of satisfaction. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. All right. Divine wisdom guides me. I am guided throughout this day in making the right choices. Divine intelligence continuously guides me in the realization of my goals. I am safe. I claim my own power and I lovingly create my own reality. I ask for more understanding so that I may knowingly and lovingly shape my world and my experiences. I balance my masculine and feminine sides. The masculine and feminine parts of me are in perfect balance and harmony. I am at peace and all is well. All right, Aries, I love each and every one of you. Please leave me a comment. Let me know how these energies are playing out in your situation. I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye, Aries.